subscribe now and press the bell icon. Never miss an update. Oh, hello guys, this is Anupi Chan. Welcome to my mathematics class. Uh, let's see today's topic, binomial theorem for any index. All right, so what is the binomial theorem you can see for any index? If n is any n is a negative integer or a fraction either positive or negative, then 1 plus x will raise to power n is equal to 1 plus nx plus n into n minus 1 by 2 factorial x square plus n into n minus 1 into n minus 2 upon 3 factorial x cube plus dot dot to infinity provided x is numerical less than unity that is mod of x less than 1 and one more thing listen to me if you want to apply this theorem okay this uh, okay this expansion then okay we have to okay x see okay x is numerical less than unity we need okay mod of x less than 1 then only this will provide you the valid uh, Okay, result otherwise okay it will not give you the correct result okay so let's try to prove I have taken very important question these questions I have taken from grade 12 uh, book uh, these are very very important type of questions how to prove this is equal to root 8 and this is equal to 2 raised to power 2 by 3 this is equal to uh, okay square root of 2 by 3 using uh, this binomial theorem for any index or a binomial uh, series let's see the question now so all questions are of the same type and exactly the same method to deal with this question if i tell you the one question then you can do very easily remaining two questions all right all three questions are very very important so let's start mm, so this uh, theorem i think clear I'm going to remove from your because I need space. Okay. Mm. Solution. First. A lit can suppose 1 plus 3 upon 4 plus 3 dot 5 times 4 times 8 and plus 3 times 5 times 7 or 4 times 8 times 12 plus dot dot is equal to I'm going to write down 1 plus x raised to power n all right now I'm going to use okay using or uh, use binomial series using binomial series or a binomial theorem for any index we will try to prove okay uh, then I'm going to write down 1 plus x 1 plus means 1 plus nx plus n and minus 1 upon to pictorial x square plus n and minus 1 and minus 2 upon factorial x cube plus dot dot to infinity is equal to is equal to you can write on this I have expanded this one instead of for this I have written this series binomial series you can say plus 3 by 4 plus 3 times 5 by okay by 4 times 8 and plus 3 times 5 times 7 over 4 times 8 times 12 plus dot dot okay so very in very easy way i will tell you how to prove it's very simple no so the people after that equating or uh, equating the corresponding terms corresponding terms equating the corresponding terms mean first first second second third third Okay, so one one no need to write down here or uh, we get or uh, we get nx is equal to three by four second second and third one. This one is a false you can okay first and only just two terms you need to write down and n minus one by two factor it means two or uh, x square uh, is equal to your 
3 times 5. Okay, now you can write down 3 to factor, no problem. 4 times 8. Or, I'm writing here, or you may write down uh, n, k, and minus 1 by 2 factor means 2. x square is equal to 5, 3 is a 15 over uh, 4, 32. Okay, uh, no problem here. Now see, we have value of an x. Okay, you may write down like this way. Uh, you can just multiply n square minus n. Uh, okay, times your x square uh, is equal to 2. You can write down here 15 by 32 times 2. Or I'm writing, okay, nx whole square minus nx into x is equal to 15 by, okay, uh, sorry, 16. Uh, 32 goes by 2 is 16. So very easy, okay. All right, just okay. Uh, second term, right? I will uh, just simplify this one now. So you can use the value of nx and x 3 by 4, 3 by 4 whole raised to power 2 minus nx again 3 by 4 times x is equal to 15 by 16. You write down your using first. Okay, using first or next step is your 3 by 4, 9 by 16 minus 3 by 4 times x is equal to 15 by 16. Or yeah, you may write down this one 9 by 16. Uh, okay, uh, all right. Uh, minus 3 by 4, x is equal to 15 by 16, minus 9 by 16, or you may write down, minus 3 by 4, x is equal to, here, yeah, 16, 15 minus 9, I guess, okay, 7, or, uh, no, 7, no, 6, okay, uh, uh, 6, 9, okay, 15 minus, okay, 9, 6, uh, it goes okay. We can simplify our uh, x is equal to 6 by 16 times okay, uh, negative so 4 by 3, negative 4 by 3, and you are going to get here 4 4 are 16 and 3 to 6 4 are 24 for 16 3 is a 48 and the minus 1 by 2. So here. We got to key x is equal to minus negative 1 by 2. Alright. I need space. So I'm going to erase your uh, x. Okay. Here I think you understood. Now. Okay. Mm -hmm. Alright. So. Or x is equal to. Now I'm. Also using this after this or x is equal to negative 1 by 2. Now putting, now we need the value of n also putting x is equal to negative 1 by 2 in first. Okay, uh, in first, uh, okay, if you forgot, you can see in first we have written an x is equal to uh, 3 by 4. Alright, in first, okay, putting in first we get. So instead of x, you need to write a negative 1 by 2 is equal to 3 by 4. Or n is equal to uh, negative, okay. Or uh, 3 by 4 times 2 is equal to, here yeah, we are going to get minus 3 by 2, alright. So n. So this is the value of uh, n, this is the value of uh, x. So almost work done, right. Now final step we need to write down. Okay, so therefore, uh, okay, therefore, uh, 1 plus 3 by 4 plus 3 times uh, 5 over 4 times 8 plus 3 times 5 times 7 over 4 times 8 times 12 dot dot is equal to, we supposed to okay, get this is equal to 1 plus x raised to power n. By using the binomial series, we got the value of x is equal to minus 1 by 2 and value of n is minus 3 by 2. Let's put the value here. Uh, 1 plus, so, okay, x. Uh, your value of x is negative 1 by 2. 
uh, and the value of n is also negative 3 by 2. Yeah, it becomes minus 1 by 2 raised to power minus 3 by 2. Yeah, 1 by 2 raised to power minus 3 by 2. Okay, so easy, not so difficult. Little bit lengthy, right? Okay, now you have to make your positive. So by doing reciprocal, you make, you can make power positive. You may write like this, pay 2 raised to power 3 whole raised to power 1 by 2. 2 raised to power means 8. 1 by 2 means square root. So square root of 8, okay, yes. So on the right hand side of the first question, uh, we have square root of 8 is equal, okay? So proved, hence the proof. Hence the proof. Like this way we can prove. And the remaining two questions are also of same type. Exactly. You need to use the same method. You are going to definitely get the res uh, proof of the remaining two questions. <music> uh, you will not have any problem. I'm sure. I'm pretty sure. I'm confident supremely confident you can get uh, if you get any problem you have an option you can use you can write on in comment box all things you will get in free of cost thank you very much for watching bye bye